Good morning. So today is going to be quite a fun video. Um, we are going to be comparing, not comparing, reacting to some of my old photos and um, and a little uh, bonus for, for you guys today, my dog seriously, is that uh, I will be giving a little bit of some tips in terms of some photos because some of my photos um, I used to be quite overweight and you know during my uh, journey to transitioning I also uh, struggled quite a lot with acne so I'm gonna give you guys some tips and tricks as well on how to get rid of that it's currently very early in the morning so you can hear lots of birds and I am also um, wearing a shirt because it's surprisingly quite cold here so let's get to it enter go go so First photo, let's go. So this photo, um, that was my first year in university. I was quite the chubby uh, beast that I was <laughs> back then. Um, yeah, that what that's what happened was um, I dislocated my elbow the year right before I actually went to university and I just went all out like crazy. I was just like, I'm just gonna eat. I didn't exercise at all. Prior to that, I actually did Thai boxing for five years, and then that happened, so I just didn't care anymore because I, I, w I was at the point where, like, you know, when you're someone who, used to, who exercises all the time and you're, you're, you're take, that's taken away from you, you know, I, I got kind of depressed, so I just ate my feelings away. <laughs> so, yeah. Okay, this picture. This picture was when I first started um, doing weightlifting. I think it was, like, the first few months of me weightlifting um, I really fell in love with it and the reason I actually there was still pre testosterone the reason I actually stuck with it was because it was actually something I really liked you know when you find something you like you're able to maintain it and do it for a long time so you know that was the year what year was that Let me look that was the year god it's in that's, Five years ago, six years ago, where is it now? 2000, 2016, 2016, yeah, that's a while ago. So there, see, that's another proud moment, another proud photo of me showing my guns because, you know, I had just gone to weightlifting and actually that's the thing. Um, when I actually started getting into weightlifting, I, I didn't quite watch my diet. I only started uh, adding exercise. I still wanted to enjoy what I ate and when you build muscle, you naturally burn a lot more fat. So I was losing a lot of fat, even though I wasn't trying. I wasn't, that wasn't my goal at the time. And then, ooh, <laughs> that's just a comparison photo of how I, at my peak heaviest weight to my current at the time progress of um, losing body fat. So, <laughs> I thought I was so cool. Um, I at the time I always kept my hair like that, you know the the emo style at the time, and and that was the first time like I actually had a kind of like a faux hawk. I thought I was being cool, but <laughs> I was it's cute, it's cute. So this photo is when I actually started um, concentrating on trying to lose fat because after I gained quite a bit of muscle I wanted to know what how much muscle I gained if I shed off all the fat so that's when I started adding cardio to the mix so I did a lot of flag football at the time at, at my university even though we're in Thailand we had um flag football club because it was an international university and the coach um he's from America I love him his family I we call them we call them mom and dad as well <laughs> that's why well, that's why you just love these people man one more photo pre pre t so there, that's when I started losing quite a bit of fat and gaining quite a bit of muscle. And just so you guys know, you can actually build a legitimate body. You know, you can build quite a lot of muscle mass even without being on testosterone. So don't be discouraged. Don't be like, hey, I'm gonna take testosterone first then build muscle. No, do it now. Because when you actually start taking testosterone and start building muscle, it's gonna pay dividends. You are gonna grow even quicker. So let's go to my picture of, oh, there we go. This is during like my first um, 
this was like the first day of taking testosterone i was trying to compare what my my face and my body would look like so i'm just gonna put all those four pictures here you see now um yeah it was very exciting <laughs> and then uh yeah i was slowly gaining weight but the weight that i was gaining was actually muscle you do gain a lot of weight initially when you start taking testosterone first because your body is actually adapting to it and um, you're actually replacing muscle with some of the fat that your body has so here's another photo of me actually during testosterone i think this was the this was the third month of testosterone so muscle mass started coming quite quite a lot and also a little bit of fat too yeah you're gonna get a little puffy because your body is still retaining all that water you know your body is reacting to the hormones so you're gonna get a little bit swollen you're gonna get a little bit puffy but you're also gonna build muscle mass but that will all go away don't worry so here's another picture uh, this is when i did the spartan race i'm not sure if you guys know the spartan race um i was still a little bit chubby there too well not chubby but i mean like puffy because of the water retention on my face but um a lot a lot of muscle mass i think this was around like my my fourth month on being on testosterone and then here is the picture of when i was after top surgery so top surgery was around seven months on testosterone as you can see my face is quite puffy because of the ana anesthesia all the medicine that was going in my body um yeah, but you know, I have a video on top surgery. I'm not gonna explain or go into too much detail of that, but that was probably one of the happiest moments of my life. Uh, here's just another photo of, you know, so you can see the comparison of the muscle to fat ratio that you go through when you do start building your body. So during the first year or so, I didn't get much acne, but going to my second year, if you can see this picture, I'm starting to get acne. My face shape is starting to change quite a bit. Here's another photo just so you can see um, what's happening in terms of my acne situation. And here is just another picture to show you like the puffiness of like when you do start getting muscle initially, it's quite puffy. But like I said, you know, you're gonna water retention, I'm not gonna repeat myself too many times. So here, let me go down and see some more pictures here. You can see, like I said, acne situation going on but my face is changing quite a it's starting to change even more you know your face is just continuously changing and um just so you know the acne situation it's not just on your face it's anywhere in your body where hair starts to grow don't worry it is temporary where hair grows you're gonna get acne just because your pores are getting clogged you know your your, your body is creating new hair follicles your pores are getting bigger so they're getting clogged um, so eventually they do go away don't worry like look at my face um, the second year wasn't as bad it was second year approaching to third year that my acne got really bad um, here's an example picture of the acne that's just starting um, my face wasn't always as clear you know I'm thankful this was like third going to fourth year that's when my face started becoming clear again because Prior to actually ha uh, taking testosterone, my face was pretty clear. I didn't have much acne. Um, yeah, so that, that was the situation with that. Also, I think I started getting acne a lot because here's a good picture. This was during COVID too. <laughs> so that's when, during COVID was also my third, uh, like beginning of the third year because that's when my facial hair started growing in a lot. Um, that's a good picture showing it and uh, yeah, let me let me show you more clearer pictures of of the acne situation going on. Yeah, it's a pretty it's a pretty bad one. Um, yeah, it wasn't fun. It was. It's not nice. <laughs> it wasn't great. But if you look at my muscle mass, this is when everything started falling into place. Um, body fat redistribution was starting for me at least was starting to really take its shape i started because uh you know all the, the the swole puffy muscles started becoming lean muscle mass uh, my body started looking different if you can see as well mm, yeah and that's when i also um integrated i also did a lot of cardio and damn here's just another picture of my, my acne it was bad <laughs> it was really bad 
here's a picture of it when it's starting to go away now it was just like the red temporary acne scars um, that's when everything started getting better and then if you can see here that's just, just a funny picture for you guys <laughs> but if you can see actually the muscle mass is a, little, a lot different now for if you remember we saw the the puffy muscle mass and now that is quite lean and dense muscle um, it does make a bit of a difference and here are some pictures from the archives just a bit of secret pictures um, I was going through a breakup so I decided to reward myself with a photo shoot so I did and here are just a couple of pictures um, that's when I was trying to get really lean but in process of trying to get really lean at that point was um, as when I met my current girlfriend so I only got lean for a bit <laughs> and then I met my girlfriend and then I uh, was still getting lean but you know I had different priorities at the time so here's just an example of photo of me that was after a run of me trying to still get lean yeah so after that was after I met my girlfriend and um, there's a lot of photos of photos there's a lot of photos of just me and her so I'm not gonna go through that too much and then maybe Oh yeah, by the, by the way, like I said, after those photos, that's when my acne completely cleared and now I barely have zero to none. So it's like very, very, very rare case and like once every two, three months I will get acne, but just like one, one dot. And this is me um, sometime last year when we just moved into our new condo. As you can see, I did keep my body shape pretty well. That's when I just first got Hunter when he was like, a baby so I did a lot of running a lot of exercise that was prior uh, that was before me getting my knee injury and then after my knee injury again I got kind of chubby because I could not exercise let me let me find a picture of me before I got back into the gym yeah that's what I looked like with my knee injury I just got a little bit pudgy I was getting pudgy again because I didn't exercise and then now that's me prior a few months later when I started be able to exercise again and yeah and just a few pictures of judo just some secret pictures that I don't really show you guys because I love judo you know and yeah so as you can see this is me now and um, I hope you enjoy me reacting to some of my older pictures but it was just kind of like a run through as well a little bit of like a comment a commentator video a commenting video of like you know me throughout the years of my uh, pre-testosterone days to now so um, I hope you guys enjoy if you like please give a like subscribe if you're new and I will see you in the next one